Okay, we're back for more at Nancy Drew. How's everyone doing? I'm here, Gibbs. We have to call Bess because we have to figure out the name of the dog. So let's go ahead and give Bess a call quickly. Uh, we uh, need her. We need you, Bess. Hello? Hi, Bess. How you doing? Great. I just took a nice, luxurious bubble bath and I'm ready to boogie. When are you coming back here? That's still kind of hard to say, but listen. Remember that old photo of a boy and his dog you said you saw in that box of stuff Henry sold to Lamont? Yeah. Did it look like it was maybe taken in the 1920s? That's exactly what it looked like. Why? Because I need to find out the name of Bruno Bollet's dog. And if that boy was Bruno, then that was probably his dog. Was there any writing on the picture? Yeah, as a matter of fact, I think it said Bruno. That's all it said? Just Bruno? No, it, it said Bruno and, but whatever came after and was hidden by the frame. I really need to know the name of that dog. Oh, no. No, you don't. No more snooping. Uh-uh. Bess, just get into that box again and see if the dog's name is on that picture. That's all I want you to do. How? I can't just go waltzing into Lamont's back room. And he's for sure as heck not going to fall for that sneeze contraption again. There must be some other way you can distract him. Please, Bess, I can't tell you how important this is. You've got to do this for me. Please? <laughs> I'm tempted to say no. Nancy, you want it done? you got to come down here and do it yourself, and then we're going to party. Uh, all this work and no play makes Bess very okay. sad. Okay. We're not going to have any fun here until you solve this mystery, and since you can't do that until I do this... Okay, I'll sneak into the back room and take another look at that photo. I mean, I will if I don't screw up. Think positive, Bess. You're going to do fine. You bet I am. In fact, I'm not going to call you again until I have seen that picture. I'm going in. You go, girl. You go, girl. <laughs> oh, wow. It just put me right inside the store, huh? Hello, Lamont. Hey. You know, I still feel guilty about that sneezing thing, so how about I go and get you a nice big bowl of gumbo? What? Just so happens I'm starving, so hey, you got a deal. Great. I'll be right back. All right, gumbo time. Evening. What can I do for you? I would like some granny seafood gumbo, please. Can I get a gumbo to go, please? Enjoy. Mmm. Oh, uh, we forgot to put hot sauce on there. Hopefully that doesn't matter. Well, we're here. We might as well talk to the doctor. Hello, doctor. How may I be of service? I hear that you're a member of the Jolly Rogers crew. Is that true? Perhaps I am. Perhaps I am not. I'm sure someone as charming and attractive as yourself has her share of secrets, too. Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Be that as it may, just what is a crew? I was gonna ask Crews are organizations question. whose primary purpose is to put on parades during Mardi Gras. They also put on fabulous parties. Very private parties. Members only. Some consider crews to be private clubs. Secret societies is a term others have used. However, back in the 1990s, the city decided not to issue the Jolly Rogers any more parade permits, unless they opened their crew to pretty much anyone who wanted to join. So, refusing to be blackmailed, they chose instead to simply not put on parades anymore. As far as the city is concerned, the Jolly Rogers no longer exist. Ah, you guys went underground. Was Bruno Bollet a Jolly Roger too? Perhaps. Perhaps not. Guess I'll be running along. I've enjoyed our conversation immensely. <laughs> he's a charmer. Whoa, he disappeared. I was going to talk to him again, but he's gone now. Aw. Wait, what? Oh, we got to go inside. Would you like some gumbo? Got my gumbo? There you yeah. go. Yeah. Enjoy. Mm -hmm. That hit the spot. Thanks. Ah. Uh... Maybe I'll have another look around in here. Enjoy. 
See, I knew I was going to have to put the hot s sauce in. Silly game. Uh, did you not see me hesitate when I put the lid on? Uh, what looks good to you? More gumbo! Can I get a gumbo to go, please? Eat up! This time with hot sauce. Yeah, get in there, hot sauce. Frank's hot sauce. Mmm. I put that... <laughs> never mind. There's a commercial with a... Yeah, never mind. <laughs> I'll just move right along here. Okay, how would you like some more gumbo? Hot off the press. More gumbo? Yeah. You still look kind of hungry to me. Mmm. Mmm. Uh-oh. Oh, you're gonna have to excuse me. Wow, that's fast-working gumbo. <laughs> uh, all right, back. Here we go. That uh, was here, wasn't it? Bruno and... Uh-oh, I better get out of here. Bruno and Grant. Okay. Grant? The dog's name was Grant? That's what it said on the photo. Kind of a weird name for a dog, huh? Yeah, well, Bruno Bollet was kind of a weird guy. Hey, thanks a lot, Bess. You've been a huge help. I'll tell you, being sneaky takes a lot out of me. I'm exhausted. I still don't know when I'll get back there, so just kind of hang loose, okay? Story of my life. Call me if you need me. I will. Bye. Aw, I'm starting to feel bad for Bess. She doesn't get to have any fun. Come on, Nancy. Bess wants to have some party time. You're ruining it. Okay, let's see if we can find Grant in here somewhere. I'm assuming it's a... F in here somewhere. Uh... Pablo, Sky, Ulysses Tennyson. Oh, look, Derek Grant. So what do I have to do here? Do I have to put it in here? No, it doesn't look like I have to anymore. Okay. Withering Roots Memorial? Alright, fine. We'll go to Withering Roots Memorial. Just gotta remember where that is now. I think it was here, right? Wait. Oh, yeah, okay. So it's basically left from the fountain. Something like that. Let's go find it. Once more to the graveyard we go. I almost wish that there was more laser puzzles. Instead of this graveyard uh, hunt here. Henry, just you just stay there, okay? Don't get in my way, please. Thank you. Alright, withering... I think it's this way, right? Nope. This way? Oh no, I gotta go to a uh, forward one spot. Then left. Okay, here we are. Derek Grant. Hey, a pirate hat! And an eyeball. Are you crazy? All that for one eyeball? <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow. Alright, fair enough. Now. Oh, what's this do? Oh, it just brings me back here. So what I really want to do is to get a piece of fruit for my iguana. If I could just remember where I got that fruit from. Was it over here somewhere? I thought it was on this tree here. Oh no. This is not it. Back up. Which tree was it? Hmm. Okay, well we'll figure that out. I, I recall getting it, but I just don't remember which tree it was. Henry! You just gonna sit there? Yes? Did you know that Bruno was a member of a group called the Jolly Rogers? No. Should I care? Maybe not, but I care. They apparently ran around wearing skeleton man costumes. 
Don't know anything about it, sorry. Really? Really? I'll stop bugging you now. Groovy. <laughs> Groovy? My goodness. Uh... That was fast. Yeah, well, I thought I would bug you. I'll check back with you later. Groovy. Wow, he's just a hipster, is he? Alright, so do we have more stories to unlock? No, not here. Uh, this one. What do we have to do? I think we have a couple more to go here. Oh yeah, I need to go back to that place with the shovel. Steps in the right direction. Uh, start where Charlie Wicker sleeps. Oh yeah, I remember that now. Alright, let's go to Charlie Wicker Graveyard. Now, if I just remember where that was, we would be all set. Uh, probably should have looked at my mini-map. Oh well. Probably. No, that's 40 winks. Oh, is this where the fruit was? No, that's where Bernie is. In a boat. Hmm. I'm trying to remember now. No, nope, that wasn't it. Nope, that wasn't it either. I think it was this way, wasn't it? No, I wasn't going to be there. Nancy's just going to walk through everything again. Nice view from here. Aha! Alright, so we're going to go ahead and do this puzzle. Uh, wait a minute, I probably... I know I did the... What do you call it? Charcoal etching of it or whatever. But, uh, I also wrote it down on a piece of paper, too. It's funny, I don't see it here anymore. That's weird. Did I do this off-camera? I, I wonder. Let me just try it again. I think I might have did it off-camera. No, it's not letting me do it now. Huh, weird. Flashbacks are strange. Alright, where's my notes on this? Let's see here. Right here. Yep, so I have a piece of paper right here. Alright, let's do it, Charlie Wicker. We got to do your puzzle. Your crazy puzzle. Alright, so first order of business is west. So, do I go for west? One. Okay, then we go north. Two north. And then we go east. We go one east. And then we go south. Okay. Then we go west again. Two west. Doesn't that look more like a spoon to you? <laughs> sure does to me. Okay, so north. Two. West. Wow, this is going to take forever. Oh, I lost track now. Shoot, I don't know if I did this one right. Oh well. I might have to redo this because I forget if I clicked it. Oh, okay, maybe I did do it right. I sure hope so. One yeast. North. One yeast. Three north. East again. 
four east. And then we have to go south. We're almost finished. We are almost finished. Wow, five whole south ones. We're almost at the front entrance again. And then last is west. Two of them. Uh, do we have to dig? Probably. Woo! What the heck is this? What do we have here? Oh, eyeball! And an arm! Why do we need an eyeball and an arm? I don't know. Ah. Uh, cool. So are we done in here then? Looks like we are. Let's go back. Somewhere. Actually, you know what? Let me just save it here quickly. There we go. Now where should we go? Uh, how many actually eyes do we have? 19 eyes. We still need six more to go. Wow. Whew. That's a lot of eyes. Well, we're going to have to get out of here eventually, aren't we? Oh yeah, we've been here already. Uh, I guess we can go back and maybe talk to the gardener a bit. Hi there. Hello again. Oh. I'll leave you to your potting. Come see me anytime. I will keep that in mind. Thank you. What? Nice talking to you. Come see me anytime. <laughs> I wasn't trying to see you. I was trying to turn around. All right. Let's uh, head back over to this spot here. So we have these feathers, right? And oops, that's not what I meant to do. No. How do I reset this now? Shoot. That's not what I meant to do. There's feathers in here. Um If I leave, will it just reset? Let me just see if I can go inside. Well, I did look. I did save the game, so I can always... Uh, let's see if it's reset. Yeah, okay, cool. Phew. Now, uh, we have to look in our book, I think. Key to the statues. Yeah, see, so we need to find out what, how to do the statues here. Let's see here. Varian statues hide secrets bound. Mechanical feathers from metal were pound. Wires and springs and levers were wound. As levers are pulled, solutions compound. A feather stands up, another falls down. You won't need to peek if you listen to sound. Inside this drawing, a solution is found. Master of Buzzards drops key to the ground. Okay, so it looks like we're trying to do this here. Uh, and then we have to do something about pirates. Probably have to dress uh, the Iguana off in a pirate outfit would be my guess. Alright, so we need to have it basically two in the middle up and the outer extremes down. Uh, I don't know what that does. Wow. Okay, so that's actually what we want, right? So that one's cool. What if I do it again? What does that do? It stays up. Okay, well we want the other extreme done. So what does that do? Wow, this is taking forever. 
Oh, look, it only goes up like halfway. Or I guess it's on an angle, I guess you could say. Like, okay. So I probably have to do that one twice then. Fair enough. And then we'll do this one over here. And then we'll do this one. And then I want to have a look at it. Okay, well we're pretty close, except this one needs to be out of the way. Uh, about that one. I'll have another look. Oh, I guess those sounds it's making are pretty clicky. Ah, oh, look, see? Now all we need is just this one here. These are perfectly straight up. Oh, that's that's actually a pretty cool puzzle. So that's this one here. And that should do it. Oh, ho, 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 ho! Beautiful. Awesome. That's a cool key. Oh, we never saw this last time, I don't think. Uh, how do I... I know that there's some stuff here I need to turn around. Here we go. Let's unlock it. One. Wow, it's a key, or I mean eyeball. Huh. So I'm assuming that they're all eyeballs. Wow, we're gonna get four eyeballs right here, folks. That's cool. We only need two more eyeballs. We are rocking and rolling. Uh, we're going to pause right here because that's a uh, episode finished. We will be back and we will look for fruit and we will go visit Iggy and put him in a bunch of costumes because that is cool. Thank you all for watching. Nancy Drew. We'll see you next time. <laughs>